Hi, hello friends. Welcome to Brighter API. I am Milind Mehta. In this our next tutorial, we are going to learn our next hacker rank implementation challenge with the challenge name is Pitching the Number. So let's go to our hacker rank account and let's solve the challenge. So friends, this is my hacker rank account and the challenge is Pitching the Number. So uh, let's uh, let's understand the problem. Given an array of integers. Find and the print of the maximum numbers of the integer. You can select it from the array such that the absolute difference between any two number is chosen. The integer is less than or equal to minus one. Okay. So what should be the first line? First line should be the integer that uh, how many integer they are going to be a provide of the array. Okay. And the second line is that contains n space of integer describing the respective value which is from the a zero a one to a n minus one and what should be the output? Output should be a set. Okay, so let's let's understand. A single in integer denoting the maximum numbers of the integer you can choose from the array such that absolute value difference between the two of the chosen numbers of the list chosen number is less than or equal to minus one. So uh, let's understand the input. Okay, so let's understand the same input in the PowerPoint slide. So as an input, what they are saying that they are inputting the six number as an input, and they are inputting the six values four, six, five, three, three, and one. So if we are shorting it, for the our understanding that the shorting is the one, three, three, four, five, and six. Okay. What we need to find out, we need to find out a group of set where this of all the set the difference is less than or equal to minus one. So okay. So uh, if we are understanding from the uh, shorted array, so one minus three is equal to uh, is equal to two. So it will not uh, consider. Okay, three minus three. Okay, is equal to a uh, zero. So it's my mistake. Okay, so three minus three is equal to zero. Three minus four is equal to what? Three minus four is equal to what? Four minus five is equal to what? So if we are consider from four minus five is equal to one, but three minus five is equal to Okay, so what could so what could be a set of group of set? So three, three and four. Okay, so three, three and the four. Yes, so three, three and four. Where you will find all of the set, the difference is less than or equal to one. So if you will find out from three minus three is equal to zero, three minus four is equal to one, and the three minus four is equal to one. So what should be the our answer? Our answer should be a three. Okay, so number of set. A set of the number. Okay, so let's let's understand the second input. So what second input says is they are inputting a six value and the they are inputting one two two three one and two. If we are shorting it one one two 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 and the three. Okay, what we need to find out we need to find a group of set where all the set of the difference is less than or equal to one. Okay, and we need to find a maximum set. Okay, so in the, uh, what 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 could be shared? So one minus one is equal to zero. One minus two is equal to one. Two minus two is equal to what? But one minus three is equal to two. So it would not be. So what could be a set? One two one two and two. So three times two and twice a uh, one. Okay. So so let's let's uh, same method applied in our Java logic in the hacker end account. So let's go to our again hacker end account. Okay. So. Here was the challenge. We have understand the same input, okay, and the output. So we need to find a group of set where the all the difference is less than or equal to one. Okay. So let's write the code. So what they have done till here that they have created a solution class, one public static void main method, and they have taken n number of n integer and they are taking up all the integer value. So what we need to do a part, we need to a sort an array. So. Uh, what we need to do is we need to a certain array uh, sort. So what 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 array they have taken? They have taken an array as a a. Okay. Okay. Now now we need to find out the highest count. So we will take a one one variable that highest count is equal to zero. Okay. For integer i is equal to zero. So we need to iterate a loop for uh the understanding it and uh, for the identifying that all the iterating the number okay 
So uh, we are taking a look where we will iterate a a array of a. Okay. Now we need to find the current count as well. Okay. So we will take a variable that current count is equal to zero. Okay. Now we need to take a maximum set of the number. So we need to take an another loop where we are we are taking it uh, j is equal to zero, j less than or equal to i, and we j plus plus. Okay. So uh, we here we need to uh, so here first loop will become and we are iterating it. Okay. So uh, we we will find the current count current count plus plus. Okay. Now if current count okay now 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 okay now what we need to do before uh, making a plus plus of the current count what we need to do we need to identify it we need to find a what a absolute value so we will find an absolute value so a of i minus a of i minus a of j of j okay uh a of j should be less than or equal to one okay we are finding a absolute number so here what we have written okay math okay a of i minus a of j is less than or equal to one then only we need to plus plus of two Okay, so that much time the loop will be iterated. Loop will be start from the zero and it will loop th that much of the time. Okay, so if the current count, if the current count, current count is greater than of highest count, if current count is highest greater than of the current count, then what we need to do? We need to just initialize the highest count with the current count. Okay. So, okay. Here. So that's it. Now what we need to do? We need to just print uh, highest count only. Okay. Uh, out of this loop, we need to print it. System dot on dot print alarm. Okay. Print. It. What we need to do? We need to print it. Okay. So let's run the code and identify that uh, code is running now. now. Okay. So we have passed the initial test cases. Okay. So let's submit the code and uh, understand it. We have passed all the test cases or not. So congratulations guys, we have completed the picking the number for challenge. Uh, we have solved this with the very easiest way. Uh, please do like and subscribe the Brighter API. Please also visit the brighterapi.com and also you can clone our GitHub link. GitHub.com slash the Brighter API and where you can find the hacker and solution repository. Okay, thank you guys. Thank you for watching my video.